Hello! So, this is the first sort of kind of beauty related video that I'm doing on this collab. Last week was introduction so you guys could get to know us. And yeah, this is the uh, spring kind of inspired makeup tutorial. And I'll just go ahead and show you the look so you guys know what you are looking at. Alright, so this is the look. I really wanted to experiment a little bit with lights and darks with this look because a lot of uh, pastels are used in this for spring looks, but I wanted to put in a little bit more of a depth into this look, so I used yellow, orange, and reds and stuff like that. And I hope you enjoy this sort of like deeper spring look. The first step I'm going to be doing is my Urban Decay Primer Potion. I'm just going to be applying that to the entire lid and blending it out. Alright, so the first thing we're going to be applying is a color into the crease. And the color is going to be a yellow. So I'll go ahead and take it. And this is my uh, Coastal Scents 88 Shimmer Palette. And I'm going to be using this yellow right here. I'm going to be using that with my Essence of Beauty Large Crease Brush, which looks like this. And like I said, it's going into the crease, concentrating more on the inner part of the crease because it's going to show more there. And just bringing it out. Alright, using the same brush, I'm going to be taking an orange from the palette now. And this orange, I'm going to be mixing two of them. Two or three? Three. Mixing this one, this one, and a little bit of this one. It looks like a, a red, but it's really a dark orange. So just mixing those, and it makes a nice vibrant orange. I'm going to be applying that uh, also on the crease, but more on the outer side of the crease. next color we're using is, I was going to do a red, but I decided to mix a little bit of black into it. So I'm taking this red here, this one right here, and I'm mixing it with just a little bit of black. This color is going to go into the outer V. The next color is going to be from a palette that I have from Jaffra, and it's called the Sea Treasures palette. And I'm going to be taking this color here, and it's in shell. It's a very nice kind of yellow toned, uh, shimmery white, and that color is going to go on my brow bone, and I'm going to be applying it with this Sonia Kashuk uh, medium all over lid brush. And this is one of their bamboo brushes, and it looks like this. It's nice and fluffy. And that's going here in the crease, taking it down a little bit to blend out any color that might have gotten a little bit high. The last thing we're going to be doing is taking a flat brush. I'm using the Sonia Kashuk Flat Lid Brush, and I'm going to be taking a white and this is going to be going in the lid. I'll show you the white I'm using. The white I'm using just pretty much a standard white, but you can use any white that you have. I'm using this one right here. It's got a bit of a pinkish tone to it, which also goes really well with the theme of this look. All right, that's it for the eyeshadow we're using on the eyes. Next for mascara, I'm using the Benefit Bad Gal Lash Mascara, and just applying that to the lids. Not lids, eyelashes. Durr. Alright, so that's it for the eyes. I'm going to zoom the camera out so I can do my cheeks and lips and stuff. Okay, so for cheeks, I'm using my Hard Candy Living Doll Blush, and it looks like this. Let me open it. Hold on a second. Alright. Looks like this. 
It's a very pretty pink color. And I'm applying that with my blush brush. Where did it go? Okay, it's right here. I'm applying that with my blush brush onto the apples of my cheeks. For lip color, I'm going to be using the Hard Candy Plexigloss, and this is in the color Honeydew. Looks like that. It's a really, really pretty peachy kind of orangey shade. And that is going, of course, on the lips. Alright, so that's it for the spring tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And there's going to be many more to come. So you guys can enjoy those. And the last thing is what my favorite sort of this is spring item at the moment. And that would definitely have to be my perfume. And this is the Lolita Lim well, El de Lolita Limpica perfume and it's gorgeous. Look at this. It's shaped like a heart and look at how much I've used. I haven't actually used a lot. It's actually very big. It's like the 2.5 um, one. 2.5? 2.7 fluid ounce one. And it's got this awesome netting and it's got some like really nice like little jewels alongside it. It doesn't have a cap but it does have like this applic like this spray. I think the shape of it doesn't like let it have a cap, but it's really nice and it's very like it looks like it's a very kind of like a fresh scent, but that it's actually a musky sort of vanilla musky um, scent with a little few notes of cinnamon in it, and I love it. Uh, I use it it's my everyday perfume, and I only have um, perfumes from the brand Lolita. Lim Lolita Lempica. I have another one from them and I just have like those two because when I like a perfume I like really like it and I don't like use other perfumes I just have like this one and the other one that I have from this one the same brand is kind of like my special occasion perfume or my night perfume so yeah that is my favorite kind of item at the moment I hope you guys enjoyed this video thanks for for watching this collab and like I said you'll have many more videos to watch this week so you got something to look forward to all right I'll see you next Monday bye